Well, hey everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, we'll be doing a tour of this tire shop. No intro needed for this video because it's going to be short and simple. And I'll just be pretty much going over everything that I put inside of this tire shop. Now, a lot of you wanted me to do the interior of this tire shop from the previous tutorial I'd done on this. And that's what I've done for you all. Now, if you don't have this tire shop made, I'll just go ahead and put it in the description down below in this video. Now let's go ahead and just do a quick spin around for the ones that don't know or haven't seen this tire shop. Pretty much this tire shop is just a generic type tire shop where I live at in real life and I based it off of that. So pretty much right over here we have the bay doors or the doors that the vehicles will drive into and we have the numbers on the doors here. So this is bay 1, bay 2, and so forth. So there's five on this side here. And we'll go on the inside and look at everything that I've done. Around back, this is what it looks like. Got a nice little storage shed here. Little building for things like tools and stuff. Dumpster pad area. Got a truck back here with... Uh, delivering some used tires things like that got a shipment door back here now again I'll go on the inside in just a second just kind of showing you the idea of this build for the ones that haven't seen the tutorial all right now this side has got five more doors as you see it starts six over there seven eight nine and ten here and then now let's go ahead and make ourselves into the front entrance right down here all right so as you see inside of here i done a lot of interior work as you see coming straight in you see i have a nice rug in the floor and the material i use on this was the cyan concrete now i'm on the ps4 high definition texture pack is what i'm using which has nice paintings like this now here's a TV on this side, TV on this side, and we have another TV over here. As you see, I have villagers in here for customers waiting for their vehicle to be called back and such like that. And we have tables here with magazines and benches there. Over here, the same thing. And over here as well. Again, I use the carpets. Uh, pressure plates, things like that, trap doors for like books and magazines. Over here I got one sitting on the bench. Somebody left their phone there. I have a villager over here. Again, I have villagers just surrounding, just scattered around. Uh, just kind of give it more life. And I have some vending machines over here for some snacks and cook machines over here all right right over here we have the bathrooms we have the ladies on this side and then we have the men's on this side oh i'm sorry sir should have knocked before i went in there all right uh never mind that okay so over here we have the front desk as you see somebody back here just standing and not really working uh we have the laptops here or the computers that they would use trash can and the floor back there uh papers and documents back here on the shelf filing cabinets things like that things that you would see in an office or behind the counter so we have this here going on back more filing cabinets and back here we have oh what's this the office we have a villager back here in the office as you see just very simple and we have a window here now this window is for the manager to sit here and look out make sure the employees are doing what they need to be doing take care of customers we have just things here like this. Alright, so let's go ahead and go around this way. 
this is the entrance where the mechanics will come through call out the uh, customer's vehicle uh, if they need problems they would come through here and talk to them and things like that right here is just some work area now you'll see a lot of uh, things scattered around tools and things like that this here the levers they're supposed to be like jacks for the vehicle so you're gonna see a lot of those over here we have a hand washing and part wash sink area we have the trash can there and over here we have toolboxes and just things like that you'll also see this here scattered around now in this texture pack this is the redstone now I thought that looked like a four-way what you would use to take off the tire of a vehicle for the lug nuts so you'll see that sitting around more tools and things like that and this is the office window here also you'll see scattered around tires and I use these buttons for like the lug nuts and things and these here are supposed to be like the rims of the tire sitting around over here is just more things like that tires with the rims on them four-way in the floor things like that all right over here we have vehicles uh, getting their tires changed so as you see this one here has two tires that are off got a jack right here and we have two tires here that need to be put on now I'll also go over the top of the building here because I didn't include none of that in the tutorial I'll get that in after all this over here we have another vehicle getting worked on pretty self-explanatory this one here either has already been done it's either pulling in or pulling out because there's all four tires on this vehicle over here we have another mechanic with the tire off of this pickup truck pretty self-explanatory if you see one then you've seen them all you pretty much know what's going on just a little inspiration or idea of the, what you guys can do for your tire shop over here I just got like spare tires and things and the redstone here because there's a button here let me take that button off you see it becomes like that put the button on there and now it becomes straight so that there is just like a tool like a tire iron in the floor so I've done that also all right back here is this doors for the shipment and then here we have another person uh, another mechanic changing the rims of this tire see I use the birch trap door for the rims of that these tires and this rim is off the lug nut setting here things like that things that you guys can do for your tire shop over here is just more spare tires and things like that what you would see in a mechanic shop here's another vehicle again the same uh, perspective same technique same thing all right and then that's pretty much it on the vehicles so now let's take a look at the other stuff that I did not include in the tutorial which is the lights which what I done was I came down my two blocks with the dark oak fence and then I got the gray stained glass full block and then I took the light block and went around the lights here to light up the area also you see here I use the polished black stone wall for the beams of the structure of the building and I got them going along this way here and then going two rows straight down the middle you see these here these are the note blocks which are supposed to be like the intercom for uh, the front desk to call back uh, which vehicle needs to be pulled in or which door or things like that what they would use to talk to customers and the employees also 
we have the motors up here I use the grindstone and the dropper for the motors of the uh, doors coming up which I thought that was pretty cool and I have the beams going up like this the caution color here I use the sandstone wall and then the stone brick wall there going up into that I have just more stuff here in the middle just you know tables and uh, trash cans over here uh, just stuff like that again just scattered around you guys can use your imagination if you do use this tire shop that's pretty much uh, all there is to this tire shop again guys um, there's it's pretty simple uh, self-explanatory uh, really not much to a tire shop in real life up here we have ventilation vents which I did include that in the tutorial as well and again guys I just wanted to show you all what I done to the place and we have a lot of uh, scattered blocks here because we have a lot of vehicles going in and out spilling oil and uh, tearing up the pavement and things like that and as you see we have a nice uh, parking lot a nice empty one I need to put some more vehicles in here but yeah that's pretty much it guys and again if you do like this tour I know that it's pretty simple and self-explanatory but again just wanted to give you all an idea or inspiration of what you guys can do to your tire shop if you do have this tire shop and if you do guys comment down below if you have built this tire shop of mine or if you have a tire shop in your world that you do something like this to yours thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in my next video